Topping our consumer view, a recall affecting many Honda drivers this midday. The automaker is recalling a million and a half cars in America because of a transmission problem. The recall includes the 2005 through 2008 Element, the 2007 through 2010 CRV, and the 2004 through 2010 Accord with four cylinder engines. A transmission part can be damaged if the car is shifted quickly between reverse, neutral, and drive, and it can cause the engine to stall. Also, in today's consumer view, the window sticker on your car can tell you a lot about the vehicle you're about to purchase, and those stickers are about to include even more information for you. The Environmental Protection Agency has proposed several changes in these labels. Automotive expert Casey Jordan is here to go over some of those proposals. And Casey, thanks for coming in. Thank you. Good to see you. Uh, I can't remember when a vehicle didn't have one of these, even growing up, but how long have, have they been required to have them? Well, uh, it was before our time when, back in 1958, there was a federal law that said uh, you had to have a window sticker on a car and the window sticker had to include basic information about the type of the name of the car, the engine, the transmission, the options and the, and the manufacturer suggested price of it. But prior to 1958 you went into a dealership and you just asked the dealer and the dealer it was up to the dealer to tell you how much the car was and what options were on it and things like that. And you know it was one of those regulations I think that really made sense that gave consumers some transparency and some And probably came for a good reason. Yes, I'm you sure know. it did. I mean you're <laughs> trusting these people to be really upfront with you. So it's nice that you can read your your information about it and make your own decisions, yeah. but there are some changes still being proposed and and we have a new sticker coming out. Yes, we do. Um the EPA uh is proposing a new window sticker and what this window sticker is going to have is some environmental information. Presently, window stickers now do have gas mileage information, and they also now have safety information. You can also check the um, National Highway Traffic Safety Information's uh, star rating system on a window sticker, as well as the fuel economy uh, information. But there's going to be some changes that are coming. And what's coming? What, what, what are we looking at? Well, the new changes that are coming mostly deal with greenhouse gas and smog emissions out of a vehicle. And there are also going to be changes due to the fact that we are seeing different types of propulsion systems on vehicles. We're seeing, you know, diesel, electric, hybrid, right. all these different things. And so the EPA has acknowledged that consumers need to know what is the fuel economy, but also what is the environmental impact as well with, um, you know, smog and emissions and things like that, where some of these electric vehicles really excel in this. So people have had a chance to vote on a new design, and uh, I guess the new one's already out. The, there's a winner, and the winner was not um, the, the grading system. Used to, you, they were going to be a, a system of A or B, but actually they've decided to go with just a pure number system of, of showing that to the consumer as well. Now these stickers, you may start seeing them on your vehicle soon for the 2012 model year, but the actual federal mandate is 2013. 2013. But some manufacturers may actually, actually go ahead and get this taken care of ahead of time. Very good. Nice topic. Thank Need you. Need more information, always. Well, Casey Jordan, uh, if you have a question for Casey, by the way, you can email him. All you have to do is email him at askcasey at kvue.com.